Hey guys, welcome back to my playthrough of God of War, Ragnarok. And, um, we are here. Come in, uh, I hear one of those birds. Oh yeah, we just landed on this area where Freya and Odin got married. It is the Goddess Waterfalls or something like that. And we're here. I'm kind of looking around because I hear one of those birds. I'm not quite sure where it is, though. In any case, I hope you're all having a great freaking day. Ugh. Ugh. There it is. See if I can kill it. My day is going to slowly come to an end. It's pretty late. It's about midnight. And uh, I've been doing stuff all day, playing here and there. So I'm a wee bit tired. <laughs> Just missed it. But, uh... I thought I'd get in about another hour or so of playtime. <laughs> a little bit higher, maybe? Come on. <laughs> Okay, a little bit higher. Ooh, I might have to back up. Damn it. Right again. There might be a better angle. Oh, we got it. That one was kind of luck, to be honest with you. So, let's see what we can do here. We defeated a few Warvads. Got some chests and areas we need to explore. I believe we've gotten all the armor pieces, haven't we? For what's-her-face? Goals. Favors. Uh, no, not this one. Uh. Oh. I don't know. I think we have. We might be missing one. So what am I supposed to do here? Oh, here we go. Okay. Do you know why I left that night, Mimir? Only a hunch. He showed me who he really was. Odin asked me to cast a protection spell on him. The one I used on my son. But the way it drove our boy mad. I refused. He was furious. Throwing every object he could find. Destroyed the room. There was only coldness after that. I tried to make it work. No one could have lived like that, your majesty. Hmm, interesting. So Odin wanted the same spell casted on Baldur on him. Interesting. Anything illuminating? Let's see. Anything I can do. No one said this journey would be easy, yet I do find myself questioning... How far I thought I'd go to finish the pilgrimage. On the way up, my foot slipped, causing me to stumble. My heart seized in my chest, and I felt I may perhaps perish at the hand of this cliff face. Thankfully, I was able to catch myself, but I suffered a nasty scrape on my knee. I believe blisters may also form on my hands as a result of the rough rocks. My back seems to have also taken a complaining to complaining about the pack I have borne for the past few days. While I'm thinking about it, my head has also begun aching. My point here is that if I can make this journey, I believe anyone can as well. Hmm. It's interesting getting to know more about Freya and Odin and the time they spend together. What the? 
Oh, that's right. I forgot. Now what? Oh. <sighs> okay. Can't destroy that. I'm hoping there's a way back around the other side of where we saw some of those other chests. Because I don't know how to get to them. But it's kind of back farther that way, so... Uh, I don't know. Oh, there's another chest over here. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Kratos, I see something. What do you see, woman? I think I can reach that. There's one. There's one up there. Sigil arrows won't work on this. I only needed two. And there's one more right there. Uh. Okay. There we go. Easy peasy. Too easy. Give me something good. Oh, and a blood mead. Okay. Of course. Of course. Well, this might be a pain in the ass. Watch out! It's a soul oh, eater! Great. It doesn't belong here! We must get rid of it! Things. 
Because these things are gonna be a thing. Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, I'm about to die. Oh, great. Sure, why not? I did have a very small amount of health. You're too oh, impatient. Wait until it opens your chest to attack. Yep. Enemy behind you, Kratos. <sighs> I don't need the nagging. Okay, let's try this again. Makes it a little bit more difficult with the uh, Reavers. Just a wee bit. Okay. Let's try this again. Are Reavers, they... of course. We're just kind of looking around at the environment to see if there's anything that can help us. Uh, I think it's just going to be with our wits. Watch out! It's a soul eater! It doesn't belong here! We must get rid of it! It's explosive! Be careful! Oh boy, here we go, here we go. Why is it following me? Left side, incoming! I need to see it. What it drops is highly volatile. You're too impatient. Wait until it opens its chest to attack. Yeah, I will. I know that. Enemy oh. behind you, Kratos. Are you sure? All right, let's try this now. Please get away from me. Oh god, oh god. Ah, yeah. Ooh, that stuff hurts a lot. Protect yourself. Okay. Oh, I thought I had the Spartan Rage. I guess not. Uh, maybe health? Is there any health? Okay. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. I really need to be able to activate my Spartan Rage. I'm about to die. Oh god! Damn it! Oh, I could just get rid of these damn Reavers. Ah, that's not a lot of dodging that. God damn these things. Handle them, Freya. Alright, it should have dropped something, right? This. There we go. Oh, that hurt a little bit. On your right! Alright, where is the dumb thing? Protect yourself! Okay! Drawing! Alright, turn around, big boy. Oh, it disappeared! Blew up in my hand! Oh, 
any health anywhere. I am in desperate need. The Reavers are finally dead. Any health. Oh my god. Oh my god. No one dropped anything. Of course. Of course. Oh boy. Yeah, that's uh, a little bit frustrating. Uh huh. Yeah. Just a wee bit. Try this again. Holy potatoes. Ugh. Those Reavers, man. Oof. Try to build up my Spartan Rage if I can. Reavers, of course. Ah! Uh! Watch out! It's a soul eater! It doesn't belong here! We must get rid of it! Rot! didn't it? Oh, here we go. Oh, what do we got? I missed it. Hang on, Freya. Come on, big guy. Got it. Almost done. Alright, let's go to this side. Okay, okay. Yeah, I see that. Okay, I think it's finally dead. Yeah, hopefully I don't die from this. Let's get away from Protect this stuff. This is the last. Oh my god, I have like no health left. God. This place. Oh, we did it. It used to be sacred. Now it sits abandoned. <laughs> Vandalized. Hopefully the objects I'm looking for are still here. Well, I don't know. <laughs> but I know that was a tough fight. So what objects are you looking for? And where is, um... Where's what's her name for war, I wonder? We'll have to check that out after this. The door is shut. If memory serves, we'll need to light both of those torches to open it. See, those two? Are those torches? Are you sure? That... They don't look like torches to me. 
What else are you talking about? I mean... Are those torches? They don't look like it. Let's see. These vines are in the way. Sure enough. This is a mystic fire. Its flames are short-lived. Do we have to activate both of them? At, like, at the same time? Uh... Eh. Okay. See. It's kind of looking around. Going to try not to die. Look, over there. What? Oh. Um. Yeah. Treasure map found. The giant's toes. The giant's toes. Oh, look at this. The Jotnar may be gone from the realms, but giants still rise above the Vanir. My treasure may seem insignificant compared to its lush, sweeping boughs, but I prefer to look at it as room for growth. Hmm, let's try to remember that picture in our mind. There's a rope thingamajiggy there, and a tree thing there. Uh, we'll see if we can come across that area. We shall see. I don't think there's a way for me to knock that down unless maybe that bird will help us. Ah! Oh, maybe not. Now that it's dead. Okay. Oh, here we go. Land anything? Hmm. I haven't so far. The feast. The table is filled. Delicacies of both Vanir and Aesir origin have been prepared to symbolize the union of peoples. Succulent fruits to wheat the appetites. Served alongside the salted crispy and of young hens, boards roasted and then sauced, and honey and breads baked in the lava pits of Elga will be presented as a second course. An offering of serum has taken the center of the spread, although many Vanner will likely refuse to partake. Nuggets of tender meat for the little ones have been piled high. They will not go hungry tonight. Last but certainly not least, cakes of mead have been rolled out in great numbers to account for the thirst such festivities bring upon their guests. Tonight we dine as if Ragnarok will come for us in the morning. Cool. Man, that sounds like awesome. Gotta love a good feast. Here's some health, finally. God, it's one of these damn plants. God damn this plan. Okay. Uh, what about on the other side? I don't think I can hit it from here. Let me see. There it is. Come on, big ass hole. we go over that way um 
me just take a second look around here for a second. Here we go. Here's something. see how would i like these fires so they both say have to be lit at once hmm i mean if i like did this here but then it goes out real quick Okay, I'm not sure yet, to be honest. Guess we'll see. So much about that day I wish I could change. If only I'd seen the signs. Oh God. Oh. God. Above you, watch out. Things are annoying. Get rid of this. Now they're all dead. Thank goodness for that. Plants are certainly annoying. What is this? Oh, that's one of those plants that are dead. Excellent. Hmm. Chest. Okay. Let me look. Hmm. Oh, another one of these. Man, these are everywhere. Honestly, they What's don't... What's it say, brother? Dorian. That's not the one I wanted. Why didn't it... Weird. Whoa. It's lore, isn't it? Where is it? Uh, yeah, the historian, wasn't it? I thought it would be underneath lore markers. Oh, uh, huh. I guess I missed it. I don't know. These things are everywhere, man. I think it's a little oversaturated. Half of them that I read just don't even make any sense. And a lot of them that I read are just somewhat, you know, mundane. Like, why did you even bother putting that in the game? I mean, some of it's fine to be sure, but I don't know. I feel like there's just a lot. What is this? That blood. Or tomato juice. It's got to be tomato juice. Oh my god. That was rude. Okay. Probably didn't need to do that, but I was running really low on health. The crest of the Hewley family. One of the first families ripped apart by the war. Oh my goodness. A lot of reading. Uh, Healy's Crest. There's one big problem with living in the peaceful, advanced society that sustained itself for centuries. When war eventually comes calling, there's a good chance you won't have any bloody idea what to do. 
Some of the Van Air families wanted to fight back against Odin. Others believed they could appeal to his better nature. The Healy family split down the middle. Half of them took up arms, half refused to spill blood on the virgin soil of Anaheim, a fissure formed between the pacifists and the militants. A fissure that might have, uh, well have healed given enough time, but they never got the chance, unfortunately. The seal ki seer killed them all a few weeks into the war, quickly, indiscriminately. Whether they died with a quill or sword in their hands, they all died just... Damn. Well, that blows out bloody beefy chunks, doesn't it? You know, in the first game, they did a pretty good job building up the lore of Odin and Thor. And it's interesting, even with Thor and Odin in this game, you know, we're still learning about them kind of, you know. My circlet's here. And let me tell you. It's on that pedestal by the balcony! Oh, God. We must remove these creatures first. <laughs> I can't understand those things. Get out that Valkyrie form, Freya. <laughs> I not see a health on the ground. Look at this. The thought. Exploring. I thought for sure I saw a health fall over here. I suppose not. Well, there's several things. Exploring. Are you not gonna hit this? Guess not. We need to go talk to her first. Come on. It belonged to you. A symbol of commitment. After the ceremony, he had a new one made every week, each more beautiful than the last. He stopped when I refused to teach him the old magic. You know, my people used to send me gifts, too. So I wouldn't forget home. But after the birth of my son, they stopped, too. Had a messed up time, man. Sucks. She just came all this way to destroy it, basically. some of this other stuff. Faster way down. We shall go that way momentarily. Oh, the more Cheetos. Okay, sweet. Lot of materials, man. Lot of materials. How do I get in this room again? Go around this way in here. Oh god. Let's nice try, dude. This guy sucks, isn't he? 
Ain't that tough. Rampage of the Furies. Okay. Hello. A robust flurry attack that ends in a powerful cross slash. This is another uh, light one, is it? Okay. This one looks it's just like the old games. I'm definitely going to try this. Um, let's see. I can upgrade it. I do have enough experience. Yeah, let's do it. It does a lot of damage. Ooh, I like the way that one looks. I am surprised I've got haven't gotten any heavy runic attacks. We're definitely gonna try that out. I like the way that one looks. I really do. Okay. Um. All right. Let's go back this way. Ooh, there's still several places and several chests I need to get to. I'm not sure how yet. I'm about to see though. I can't read that from here. Let's head back and I can take a better look. Okay. Uh, will the chain... Oh, yeah, that's right. It's this way. I thought I'd feel peace by breaking it. But I feel nothing. Perhaps what you see cannot be found in the circlet. You may be right. Oh, there's enemies here. Oh god. Oh, I like that a lot. That is so good. Okay, that one kind of That was awesome. That was absolutely awesome. That was so cool. He just ripped its throat out. I mean, he just... Oh my gosh, that was so cool. Okay, so we need to activate this thing now. The word isn't complete. It's missing a piece. Okay. Any ideas? Hmm. I mean, because I don't know what to do. I'm open to suggestions. The word isn't complete. It's missing a piece. Well, how do we find out what it is? Uh... Okay. 
have anything to do with this door, does it? Because I don't know how to open this one yet either. Ugh. I'm stumped. Freya? Any help? Now there... Okay, okay, okay. Now that up there will probably solve the other part of it then. The question is, is how do I get up there? Kratos, I see something. What? What? These lamps, you mean? Yeah, I know. I don't know how to turn them both on, though. I'm gonna kind of go over here and look and see if there's a way I can climb up. Fortunately, it doesn't actually look like there is a way. Ooh, which means I have to find a way to solve this. So, hmm, what do I do here? How, pray tell, am I going to be able to light both of these lamps? see Freya any help would be great I can activate one I thought I could <laughs> oh my goodness not really sure what to do here what do you think I can activate one. Like this. Oh, what the heck? This thing on the door shined. I need to activate them both at the same time, though. Now, there is this vine over here. Would that have anything to do with anything, though? Oh my goodness, I'm not sure. Hmm. Well, what about my axe? Would my axe have an effect? Really? I mean, they need they need to be turned on fire. Oh my goodness, I have no idea. It's gonna drive me crazy if I don't figure this out. It's probably something very obvious too. How can I get both of these lit? Try this side now and see what happens. Uh, hello. I believe we have to light both torches at the same time. Yeah, I get that much. I just don't know how. How are we gonna do that? Because Freya. Now, she does have these other arrows, but it's not like they're going to affect anything that I can see. They're just the same arrows that Freya's has. Ugh. Hmm. hmm. What's that? What? What's what? 
I mean, am I missing something? Can't get back here. What about through the other side? What is this? Can you open this for me? No. There's absolutely no seeing anything through this other side. That's certainly not the way. Oh! Goodness. Oh, this is frustrating. And there's no other way up here that I can see. That's where we gotta be. And I'm assuming it's through this door is where we gotta go. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna figure this damn thing out somehow. Thinking about the resources I have. Not like these vines are gonna do anything. Unless... That made a difference when I used two of them. It's just not going to be quick enough. I mean, I am stumped. I am just absolutely stumped. Freya, help me out here. This is one of those times where I desperately need a real hint. Got this stuff going. I seriously have no idea what to do, though. I feel very stumped, very stupid. I bet it's something so obvious, too. Just something, like, right in front of me. But I don't know what it is. Um... Hold on. I thought that would have done it. Maybe that's the trick. Ugh. So three circles there. Like I said, blatantly obvious. Golly, man. Golly, that makes me feel so stupid. Now that I realize it, it's like, oh yeah, of course. Man. Oh my gosh. It was so obvious. How did I not figure that out sooner? Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm kind of getting sick of this guy's shit. Oh, 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 
Oh god, yeah, I know what's going on here. It's this damn thing. Get away from me. Freya, distract him. I gotta get to that thing. Ah. Yeah, I know. I'm trying. I forgot about that. Oh, there it is. I think we're good now, yes? Okay. Let's try this again. Ow. You bitch. Yeah. Health? Don't look that way, does it? I think that's all of them, though. It's explosive! Be careful! God, I'm still about to die. Good One left. I see the chalice. All right, you do what you got to do. From the ceremony. A symbol of reconciliation. We drank from the lover's chalice until we could hardly stand. I confided in him that night about wanting an apology from Freyr. Odin reassured me that he'd be the only family I'd need. And I believed him. One more thing we need to find. Okay. Here's another one of these things. Anything interesting, brother? Probably not, to be honest with you. A blessing on the union of Freyr and Odin on this day. Prosperity to the people of Vanaheim and Asgard. As the sun shines and the moon glows, so shall the realms remain steadfast in peace. What, pray tell, am I missing? I feel like I'm missing a few things. Oh yeah, let's go back down here. Where these other enemies were. Go. Here's one of these things on the wall. It's a denouncement from my people. Placed during my wedding. Preacher. Found outside a ruined temple in Vanaheim. Many of the realm's buildings came to ruin due to natural disaster. Or, I uh, Freya's temple has fallen for different reasons. It appears that after she felt Vanaheim, or left Vanaheim, her own followers vandalized the very temple they once gifted her. Her people saw her marriage as a betrayal, a cowardly way to pass judgment on her action. Yeah. 
I mean, she really got the short end of the stick. I mean, she married Odin to try to broker a peace to protect her people. Her own people saw her as a traitor after she did that. And then Odin just ended up betraying her anyway and slaughtering countless of her people. And then he binded her to Midgard so that she could never return here and make things right. I mean, just... Just absolute hell. And the one good thing... I mean, it kind of makes sense, in a way. Because the one good thing that came out of their marriage, in her mind, was Baldur. You know, that was her own son. Her only son, I think. I mean, maybe she had others, I'm not sure. But, uh... You know, it makes sense, because... We killed him. And, yeah, he was an insane lunatic maniac, but once again... That was because of her choice. She casted a spell on him that made him uh, invulnerable, but it took away his ability to feel anything. It drove him mad and insane. And so the state he ended up being in when we met him, it was kind of her fault. And she didn't mean to do that. Just like when she married Odin, she thought something good would come out of it, but she didn't mean to betray her people. I mean, she's made so many mistakes, all with good intentions. You know, she's tried her best to lead and do the right thing, but it has cost so much. And I think Baldur's death was just kind of the breaking point. And since we were the ones who killed him, it was kind of like, you know what? Let me just unleash all of this anger and hatred and frustration just built over all this time on us. Because after all, once she was bound to Midgard, it's not like she could really fight Odin or do anything. She was just trapped. So, you know, coming after us, you know, it, it was just one of those things that, that anger needed to vent. And we gave her the perfect reason. Thankfully now, though, uh, we're good. She's, uh, maybe not forgiven us, but... The word is complete, but I still can't read it from here. Let's head back down. Excuse me. But that anger has finally subsided, and she has kind of come back to her senses. And now we're helping her on this, well, this quest that really kind of mends her, her broken heart, you know? I mean, it, it's... Better now. No. The pain only grows. <sighs> Will I never be free of it? What more do I need to do? But we're helping her on this quest, you know, to, uh, how far is she gonna walk? You know, to kind of mend her broken heart, to mend all the pain that she's gone through. She's trying to, she's trying to undo all this stuff. You know, she's trying to make right all the wrongs that she feels that she's responsible for. Kratos would know a lot about that, I mean, after killing his own family. And doing everything for the gods in Olympus. And trying to rid himself of the guilt he felt for the mistakes that he made. He understands exactly where she's coming from. The runic word appeared over there. See it? No. It's like a bunch of Cheetos to me. Hot Cheetos. Fluka. Fluka. After all the battles I've fought... Why does the other side of this door scare me most? The most difficult battles are fought within. But this battle, you will not fight alone. Good man, Kratos. Abandon. I give you everything. My faith, my love, offerings beyond measure. You abandon me, abandon us, abandon your home. Why? So you could gallivant across the realms with the one-eyed king. Did we sicken you so, your pathetic worshippers, that you would take the first opportunity to leave and never return, and did not know true loneliness until now? Nor did I know true rage. I would revenge myself upon you, but you are not here to receive my hate. So instead I, and as many as will join me, will go to the temple that we built for you so long ago, the monument to our gullibility and your selfishness, and we will do to it what we can only hope one day to do to you oh man i mean they hated her 
They hated her. They thought that she betrayed them. And when she was bound to the realm of Midgards, she just couldn't come back here and set things straight. So it kind of made them really kind of solidify that feeling that she abandoned them. Are you ready? There it is. My final tie to Asgard. We drove that sword into the pillar together. The sword was forged for the ceremony. The symbol of our union. The stone refuses to let go. The deepest wounds form the strongest bonds. Bastard said it as part of our vows. I hate it when he's right. Asgard holds a part of me I can't sever. My bond to my son. To the Valkyries. That damn realm isn't just Odin's. It belongs to me, too. The pain he caused is his. I refuse to keep holding on to it. This sword no longer holds our legacy, but it will serve as mine. A much more fitting use for it. New sword choice unlocked. Customize for his loadout and the weapons menu. Okay. We have the Mardol, a sword commissioned by Odin and gifted to Freya on their wedding day. Melee attacks strike with speed and inflict bifrost on enemies. Hoo hoo hoo. Yeah, let's do this one then. And, uh, Runic Summon. Seriously, we have a new Runic Summon? Still Harmony. So this lets her use both swords at once. That. This does more Runic damage, but this inflicts stun. Freya wields the power of both her Vanir and Acer swords to send out damage across of both stun and Bifrost to enemies. Indeed. Ooh, we could level this up. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll use a lot of her experience, but it'll be worth it. Armor. Do we have new Freya armor? Ooh, look at that. I like that. This one looked a little, uh... No, not this one. This one. Yeah, this one looked a little kind of 
Uh, a little too bulky. Not. Yeah, I wasn't digging it. This one's not bad. But this one is interesting. It's much more colorful. Let's try it out. Garments soon for a day when all eyes are on the wearer. Okay. How about skills? As for me, I have a few things I can unlock. Let's go to her first. I've used pretty much everything. Uh, yeah, she doesn't have any experience left to use. So, uh, let's go to the Leviathan Axe this time. Vengeful Pickle. Eh. Hmm. Let me think here. Sure. This is a new one. Press L1 and R2. My god. While barehanded to quickly... Oh, I forgot about that. Isn't that what this one is? Yeah. Ooh, I like this one. Yes, I do. Um, yeah, maybe we should get this one. L1 plus R2, L1 plus R1. Let's see. Um. Let's try this one. I haven't tried the other one a whole lot. How about something for the Leviathan Axe? I don't think I have anything I can now. Maybe something weaker over here? I don't think I can. No, they're all too much now. Yeah, that's okay. It's okay. Okay. I think I'm going to switch this one up. Uh, Gil's Edge. I never really did use this one. Why don't we go back to it for now and try it? Yeah, well, let's give it a shot. I never really did use it though. Blades of Chaos. Uh. I do like this one I've got. Oh crap. Oh crap. I thought we were going to fight some kind of monster in here. Well, anyways, um, I think that's going to do it for this episode. We have recovered Freya's sword. And that is a completion of her journey. When we come... Well, not her journey, but on this quest. When we come back, we're going to go and... Um, Find this orb. Yeah. Which is somewhere right over here where we're at, I think. Crack. The vile path. Are we still doing this? Prey has found some measure of acceptance. There's nothing less for us in the shrine. Look at that. This quest is still going on, isn't it? Leave the shrine. Um. Yeah, we will in a little bit. But we're going to try to find this other orb thing for this fat little dwarf girl. In any case, guys, as always, thanks so much for watching and have a great freaking day.